morning friends welcome back to my kitchen today we are going to make a simple recipe they are pancakes they are gluten free they are yeast free these pancakes I'll name them gram and cassava flour pancakes they are sweet they are crispy they are simple and easy to prepare to our ingredients we are going to have gram flour also known as besan or chickpea flour they're also known as gabanzos we have cassava flour all these are gluten free and we are using the roasted version of the flours lightly roast them for two minutes in a skillet or a pan that that measure is two and a third cup of each we have honey two hip tablespoons we have a half a teaspoon of ginger powder 380 ml of cold water our oil is going to be olive oil and those are the only ingredients we have in a large bowl mix your dry ingredients first here we have the cassava flour we have the chickpea flour both roasted as i'd said earlier and add your ginger powder as well and mix evenly cassava flour is rich in vitamin c though easily destroyed by heat it contains resistance which is good for people who wish to lose weight very high in fiber magnesium vitamin b1 and 2 chickpea flour is rich in fiber rich in folate very good for expectant women yes and at this point we are adding water to make a runny consistency cold water enables it to retain its structure roasting the flours enable the uh, the flour to cook before us using it considering we I making pancakes which take a maximum of six to eight minutes in the pan mix evenly add your honey lastly so that you can be able to obtain an even runny consistency it is at this point that you add the honey you can use jaggery which you've dissolved in cold water you can use powdered brown sugar which is from jaggery you can use stevia as well maple syrup and this is the consistency that you're looking for a runny consistency and if you are here you will be able to smell the beautiful smell from the flowers we have our pan on the fire a half a teaspoon of oil and brush it all over the pan and using a third a cup measuring cup scoop at uh, your dough and pour it on the pan allow it to cook for three minutes on each side if perhaps it is ticking add a little more oil use a healthier oil which will not be harmful when you heat it do this for the whole dough this should give you seven to nine pancakes they tend to be crumbly because the flours we're using here are gluten free gluten is what holds the wheat flour and the rye flour in place so one can choose to use psyllium husks to bind the flour together you can use flax seeds or chia seeds also to bind them together as well and our pancakes are ready they are crispy at the edges and they are soft and chewy remember when you eat eat to the glory of God and be a channel of light where God has placed you the Lord depends on you 
Our next recipe is going to be leavened scones. They are whole wheat. They are basic and simple. If you wish to be the first one to receive a notification on the video, remember to subscribe to my channel. If you like this recipe of the pancakes, remember to give it a like. God bless you. I look forward to see you again on Wednesday. Bye. See you.